Welcome back to the Elevate Media Podcast. I am Chris Anderson, your host. And in today's episode, we're going to unravel the mysteries of limiting beliefs. What exactly are limiting beliefs? They are those sneaky, often subconscious thoughts that hold us back. They're like invisible handcuffs, telling us what we can't achieve, who we can't become, or what we can't have. These beliefs typically root our past experiences, upbringings, and even societal messages. So the question is, why do we let them control us? It's often because they're familiar, and they're fam- and that familiarity feels safe. They're like old friends telling us to avoid risk to protect ourselves from failure or rejection. Yet, in doing so, they cage us in the comfort zone where growth is limited. So how do we break these chains? The first step is to become a detective in your own mind. Identify and challenge your limiting beliefs. Ask yourself, why do I believe this? And is there concrete evidence supporting this belief? Often you'll find the evidence is lacking. So reframing is crucial. For every limiting belief, you gotta create an empowering counterpart. So if you think, I'm not good enough to start my own business, you gotta reframe that to, you know, I have a unique skill and perspective to bring to the table, and I can learn what I don't know to succeed. So that's how you reframe that. And in action is where the real magic happens. But you got to start small. Challenge yourself to step outside your comfort zone each day. And that could be as simple as speaking up in a meeting or as big as launching a new product. And you got to be consistent because that's key. you got to make a habit of questioning your limiting beliefs. Create a vision board of your goals and dreams. Surround yourself with people who will uplift you and believe in your potential. But remember, that journey, the journey we're on to overcome these limiting beliefs is not a sprint. It's a marathon. And with each step, you're not just moving forward, you're rewriting your story. So remember, when you're going out there and you hear that little voice in your head saying you can't do it, ask yourself, what evidence is there to say I can't do it? you really probably find that there is no evidence for that. And then reframe that thought to something more positive, something that shows and gives power to yourself. And then make sure you surround yourself with positive and and influential people that are going to help you on your journey and not hold you back out of scarcity or fear. So I hope you learned something from this. Take control of your thoughts Because your thoughts become feelings and your feelings become action. And our actions are what make us succeed or or not succeed. But until next time, go out there, continue to elevate your life, elevate your brand, share this with someone who can help, and we'll talk to you again soon. 